Have you ever wondered which country boasts the fastest growing economy worldwide? You might be surprised to learn that the leader in recent years is a small nation that many people have barely heard of. Gwen in South America is expecting a whooping 42.8% annual growth in 2024, up from 33% recorded last year, a growth rate that many industrialized countries and the rising economies of the Far East can only dream of. Gwen's president, Mohamed Ifan Ali, upgraded his estimates for annual growth as he foresees increased investment from the public and private sectors, Bloomberg reports. Ali also said non-oil growth was 12.6% for the first six months of 2024. Despite the huge drop in cane sugar production that fell 60% in the first half of the year due to prolonged drought, fastest growing economy led by oil Gwen is bordered by the Atlantic Ocean to the north, Brazil to the south, and southwest Venezuela to the west, and Suriname to the east, with a land area of 214,969 kilometers square. Gwen is the third smallest sovereign state by area in mainland South America, after Uruguay and Suriname and is the second least populous sovereign state in South America after Suriname. It is also one of the least densely populated countries on Earth. The country's economy grew by 49.7% in the first half of 2024, with the oil sector accounting for 67% of that growth, Ali said. Gwen produced about 113.5 million barrels of oil from January to June. And the oil sector is projected to grow 56.4% this year, he added according to Bloomberg. The world's biggest oil discovery in a generation has made Gwen the world's fastest growing country for two years in a row. The Caribbean nation is projected to pump more oil per capita than Saudi Arabia or Kuwait by 2027, and it is on track to overtake Venezuela to become South America's second largest oil producer after Brazil. ExxonMobil is the majority shareholder in the Costunum, which also includes Hesse and the China National Offshore Oil Company. Developing Gwen's over 11 billion barrels of offshore oil deposits. Gwen also seeks to monetize its downstream energy sector, particularly gas, in 2024. Gwen's Natural Resources Fund, NRF, is anticipated to exceed $3 billion by the end of 2024. The U.S. State Department say says in its latest report that Gwen, the only English-speaking country on the continent, is poised to dramatically increase its per capita wealth. So, let us come to the reality table now. You see, this is one of the most smallest countries in America after Suriname. Imagine that some countries in Africa, where many countries are being forced into one country, Everybody will be on their own. Everybody will start using their natural resources to develop their countries, their cities. Invest heavily in human capital. Do whatsoever they need to do to improve their education sector. Build health, proper and affordable healthcare system to all. Imagine many of such countries that will emerge out of Africa. There's a whole lot of countries that will emerge out of Africa that will do far better than this Gwen. That will do far more far better than many of such small countries in the world. So it is high time we as a people, we as African, we all join our forces together, unite ourselves and break this imperialist chain once and for all and regain our freedom completely.